Hi everyone, it's Darlene. It is Friday. I have the new Smart Source preview up for us to see. We will be looking at the preview for November 22. Let's go see how many. 46. That's not bad. Don't take us long. And I like this one. Usually we get a dollar off these meatballs, which I don't know if I've ever really found a very good deal for these because I myself know that I never bought any, so the deal couldn't have been that great. But uh, $1.50 off isn't bad, so I shall be looking for a deal for this coupon. And it goes out till January 3, so that's good. Sharpie. Me likey Sharpie. You know, I've never looked at these things like at Shaw's. I mean, I imagine Sharpies are expensive at Shaw's, more expensive than Walmart. Three count or higher, but you know, maybe with a buck fifty off on something small, might not be too bad. I even like highlighters for my doodling, which I have got to get back to doing because I love to doodle and I haven't been doing it. Gotta do the doodle. <laughs> so, all kinds of crafty things here. Two weeks only, they make it sound like it's special. We don't want two weeks only coupons. We want two months. Okay. Did I just see a sale on these somewhere? I'm thinking, I don't know if it might be Stop and Shop. I've started doing, um, obviously you know I do Shaw's, I've started doing uh, Stop and Shop, Market Basket, and Dollar General deals also. So if you shop at any of those stores, I'm going to try to keep those weekly, you know, those deals every week, except Market Basket had a two-week flyer this week, so there's no new deals for that. And of course, my helpers, Alice does Walmart, and Trisha does Whole Foods, and some of the, uh, the drugstores and other stuff, and I also want to start getting some Target deals, and what else, what else, what else, Hannaford, okay, so I don't know about this coupon, I will look to see for a deal, I'm trying to see, I think it says 2, uh, 12.22 of this year, but I don't see anything that says do not double, do I, hmm, okay, I know some of the stores that we promote don't have the best deals around, but the thing is, is there are some people who, wait a minute, $2 off two? Can those be very expensive? That sounds like that might be a good coupon. Oh, two weeks only. We don't like that. I don't even know how to pronounce it. Is it, is it Kami, Kami, rice crackers? Anyway. Oh, and this one will run l later. Oh, aren't they special? I know that uh, some people, you know, for instance, in North, Wa in North Waterboro, they have a Hannaford if they want to shop anything, you know, an, a major grocery store other than Hannaford. They have to either go to Sanford or Biddeford. So, you know, Hannaford deals might not always be the best deals, but it does help those people who really have that as an only choice. But then on the other hand, I say, well, sometimes a Hannaford deal for a brand name item, even with a coupon, you're better off to just buy store brand instead and still save. But I have learned in the four years of couponing and paying attention to, to different brands and what people buy, some people will not buy anything but a popular major brand. They will not touch store brand. So those are the people who need coupons for deals at Hannaford or even Walmart because I find that Nine times out of ten, the great value brand at Walmart is cheaper than any major brand with a coupon. Not always. Like right now, there's Libby's for 25 cents a can with a coupon. Libby's vegetables. So you can get good coupon deals at stores that don't have the best prices but uh, or don't double coupons. But And for those of you who don't shop Hannaford and don't, want to do the deals there you can always still look at the at the deals to get the coupon and use the coupon elsewhere i'm actually going to be doing a video on that subject to remind people that one one good way to find coupons is to look 
at deals of stores that you don't even shop at, even things like Kroger and Publix and places that we don't even have on the East Coast. Look at those deals sometimes and you'll find uh, coupons that you might want to use here in your neck of the woods. I am so hungry and tired. I went out. I haven't eaten anything yet. It's going on 3 o'clock. I'm going to cook some pork and veggies. I, have I had these crackers before? I think I have. That's not a bad coupon. Oh, and it went out till. Oops, let's go back. January 24. Like it. Like it. Like it. Beach nut. Very fancy baby food. Dollar off two. Does it say it's not restricting it to just that big container, is it? You would think so, but look, any two collagen products. So that means we can use it on the cans, unless I'm missing something, but I don't think I am. Let me test your memory. We're getting toward the end. Do you remember what the first coupon is that we looked at? Come on. What was it? Do you remember? Ooh, this looks delightful. And I noticed this goes out after Christmas. So if there's any such thing like this in reduced after Christmas, you could use it on that. This one ends well before Christmas. I do remember what the first coupon was. And I usually don't. I'll tell you. It was meatballs. Okay, this is the coupon that we like for Shaw's. There's no restrictions as to what kind of Colgate three ounce or larger, um, Shaw's a lot of times has Colgate and probably Stop and Shop too. Now that I'm doing those deals, I'll start to be more familiar. Um, often has sales for Colgate. It's like a 6.4 ounce for a buck. This will double and you get free toothpaste. And it's been a long time since I've gotten free toothpaste. Makes a great donation item. There it is. I told you it was meatballs. Okay. Thank you so much for watching. I'll be back with more soon. Be sure you check the blog for deals at darlingmishu.com. Bye.